And the Christmas tree farm business, that has not been exempt either from the nationwide shortage crisis that's impacting several other industries. Fox 43's Paula Bayoso has more on why local farms say that in order to have good inventory, you have to plan 10 years in advance. What's been the hardest thing is it takes seven to 10 years to grow a harvestable Christmas tree. Blue Mountain Farms in Harrisburg is feeling the impact of the nationwide shortage. In order to have a fair inventory 10 years from now, you need to plan for that 10 years ago. And 10 years ago, a lot of people were doing more of the artificial trees and things. So a lot of there wasn't and there were more um, environmental issues, droughts and other things that caused less planting say 10 years ago. And we're seeing the effect of that now, but nobody could have anticipated the desire for where we're at now either. Last year, they saw a spike of people interested in having real Christmas trees in their homes. This year, they're expecting the same boom. With COVID, you know, people just wanted to do something outside with their families. So last year was like a huge boom in cut your own Christmas trees and going and picking live trees. Some of the issues they face include not having enough workers. A lot of us are all facing a lot of the same hurdles and challenges, just shortages, shortages of help, you know, additional workers, people wanting to come out and help. It's, you know, wants to do the work. <laughs> it's hard. Another issue they're dealing with, many Christmas tree farms are closing. We're a tree farm, but now we're trying to sustain the customer base for not only our farm, but other tree farms that close or other tree farms that also are suffering the shortage of trees. Blue Mountain Farms will be opening next weekend. They say they will have about 1,000 sellable Christmas trees this year. In Harrisburg, Paula Belloso, Fox 43 News.